You can read your Gmail on your iPad online through a web browser just like you do on your computer, but if you would like to receive your Gmail through the Mail app, you need to connect your account in your iPad settings. First, go to Settings, select Mail, Contacts, Calendars, under Accounts, select Add Account. Choose Gmail and enter the requested information. Make sure you use your at jeffcoschools.us email, not your at jeffco.k12.co.us Outlook email. In the description area, enter what you want this inbox to be called. Jeffco Gmail is a good descriptor. Then tap Next and choose which services you want to sync. And finally, choose Save. Your Gmail is now set up. If you have more than one email account synced with the Mail app, you can toggle easily between them. Simply open the Mail app and use the button in the upper left to change from one inbox to another. Let's open the Calendar app to see if our events from our Google Calendar are syncing properly. When I open my Calendar app, I can see that events from my primary Google Calendar are syncing, but events from my other calendars and my shared calendars are not syncing. If you wish to sync multiple Google Calendars, including shared calendars, you will need to take one additional step. Open Safari or your web browser and go to google.com slash calendar slash iPhone select. Enter your Jeffco Google credentials. You will then be taken to a page with your sync settings. Select which calendars you want to see on your iPad. Remember, you can always hide a calendar if you do not want to see it from within the calendar app. Select Save at the bottom right. Now, when you open the calendar app, you will see all of your Gmail selected calendars. And in this way, you can have both your Gmail and your Google calendars on your iPad, including your shared calendars. So take a moment to set up both your Gmail and your Google calendars so that you have all of your emails and your calendar events visible to you on your iPad.